What's up guys, it's Hubs, and I'm going to be summoning for Fiora, Luca, and Yuja. That's how I say her name, because I'm not really sure. Um, <clears throat> at this point, I already have... Ooh, Yokina. Lord. Um, I have a Breaker, uh, Breaker Fiora. I have a, a Guardian Luca, and I have a Lord Yuja. So, I'm looking for... Ooh, another Guardian one. Um, I'm looking for Anima or Breaker of all of them, <clears throat> just because, um, in my opinion now, I think, honestly, I think Breaker types are becoming the best. Ooh, wow, is that two in a row? Oh my god, two Guardians. Damn it. <sighs> um, I think Breakers are going to become the best units in the game. Um, because of raids, and because raids are timed. Is that a brand? Oh god, I've never used brand seems like a terrible unit um but yeah oh my death like breaker that's pretty good i'm i'm gonna max that definitely but yeah I, i'm basically i'm on this huge breaker hype train right now i keep advocating in every video but it oh, if you're a guardian damn it well i'm maxing an adam and a breaker one of everything i summon right now because you know for trials i think they're not timed so um adam is still probably the best for survivability but breaker for raids seems ideal to me because raids are going to be something that we grind all day every day because we get an orb every hour and at some point they're going to be so easy and so simple like we'll know how to do it so well that the only thing that we can do better in raids is to do more damage and clear it faster so um even though people have done some analysis some data crunching and we've seen that the difference between breaker and anima in terms of damage for one unit is actually not that much you're gaining maybe this is a number that's completely out of my ass right now maybe like a five to ten percent increase in damage from breaker to anima which is very small but when you take that and you multiply it by six units in your squad over you know a 10 to 30 minute raid where you're just mindlessly attacking the boss over and over and over again. I think that might be quite a difference. It, it could end up being, you know, um, anywhere from like a three to 10 minute difference in terms of clearing speed, depending on how long it takes you to actually clear it. Um, so for example, if you were to run a raid and it took you 30 minutes with all anima units, in using all breaker units, it might take you only 25 minutes. So you're getting that five extra minutes and in my opinion, when you're grinding something that just takes that long, that fi uh, five extra minutes, it's huge. It's like when I used to play Maple Story, it's like, yeah, you know, we can't kill Zachum in eight hours, but you know, it would be great to kill Zachum in three hours. And then at some point, it's like, you know what? It's great to kill Zachum in three hours, but you know what? We're killing it in like two hits now. Um, and th that's how like Zachum is in Maple Story right now. Um, so, you know what? Faster is always better in my opinion, and that means breaker. So I'm a huge advocate of breaker types right now. I like I'm running all breaker rogans. Ooh, another Fiora, another breaker, not bad. Um, but I think this is it for now. I didn't really pick up anything I wanted this time, but I'm gonna keep summoning. So I'll see you guys next time.